Let's see how to find HCF or highest common factor using the method of prime factorization. Let's consider these two numbers 18 and 24. What we need to do first is find prime factors of 18 and 24 and then we find the common prime factors. So the prime factors for 18 are, um, let's use the prime factorization method divide by 2 the smallest prime number answer is 9 9 is not divisible by 2 so the next prime number is 3 and the answer is 3 which is a prime number which cannot be divided further for 24 divided by 2 answer is 12 again divide by 2 answer is 6 divide by 2 answer is 3 3 is a prime number so we stop here so the factors for 18 the prime factors for 18 are 2, 3 and 3 and for 24 are 2, 2, 2 and 3. So what are the common prime factors here? 2 and 3 are common. They are in 18 also and they are in 24 also. So what we want to find is really not only the common factors but the highest common factor. To figure out the highest common factor, we have to get these common prime factors and make a product of it. So the product of these common prime factors, 2 multiplied by 3 is 6 and therefore the highest common factor is 6. So 6 3s are 18 and 6 4s are 24. This is how 6 is the <coughs> common factor and in this case it is the highest common factor. Let's take one more example. 44 and 66. So the prime factors for 44 are um, start dividing by 2, uh, the lowest prime, uh, prime number. Divide by 2, answer is 22. Again divide by 2, answer is 11. 11 is a prime number, we stop. In case of 66, divide by 2, answer is 33. 33 is not divisible by 2. So divide by 3, answer is 11. 11 is a prime number. So we stop. The prime factors for 44 are 2, 2, 11 and for 66 are 2, 3 and 11. So what we see here are the <coughs> common factors are 2 and 11. Let's take a product of it to get the highest common factor. So the product is 22 and 22 is the highest common factor. <coughs> 